till now we have read about the motion rest and motion are the two state of the body and scalar and vector quantities now we will be reading about motion how many types of motion are there so motion are of two types let us start motion are of two type uniform and non uniform motion for uniform motion when a body travels equal distance in equal interval of time you can see it as c a body is covering 5 meter each the distance of 5 meter each in the same time interval that is 3 second so when a body is covering 5 meter that is equal distance in equal interval time this type we say to be uniform motion now comes the non uniform motion non uniform motion is when a body covers unequal distance in equal interval time or you can have equal distance in unequal interval of time also see when a body is covering unequal distance 4 meter in 3 seconds then 6 meter again in 3 seconds then 2 meter in 3 seconds theek hai so this is over here the distance is unequal and the time interval are equal for example when you go to a market theek hai on your vehicle then what happens sometimes you have to take a break sometimes you have to accelerate so you are what you are doing you are covering unequal distance in unequal interval of time also so that is non uniform motion if you come to the graph of uniform and non uniform motion uniform motion is c time it is a independent called identity 3 6 9 i have taken the same time interval as over here distance 5 10 15 20 20 same intervals i have taken so in every 3 second the distance covered in the first 3 second 5 meters second 3 second 10 meters like that i have drawn the graph it will come out to be a straight line now if you draw a graph for a non uniform motion i have taken the time to be of uniform intervals 3 second 9 12 like that distance also 2 2 meters i have taken in the first 3 seconds the body is covering 4 meter in the next 3 second it is covering see 10 meters 4 plus 10 in the next 3 meters so it will be what it is going to be a non uniform motion and the graph for the non uniform motion will be a curved line is that clear to everyone for the first 3 meters first 3 second it is 4 meter next 3 it is covering 6 that is 4 plus 6 10 meters as time is a ever increasing quantity so what will happen the body is standing at a position suppose a car has moved up to 15 meter and it is standing over here it has not moved away so what will happen the time will keep on increasing but the car is wherever it is stand still that is at rest so it will be shown by a straight line that is line parallel to the x axis okay see this is the body at rest this is a graph for uniform motion non uniform motion a curved line a line parallel to the x axis will be showing the body is at rest